So in the last video, we started from this cell and we used this keyboard shortcut, Control Shift Left Square Bracket, which enabled us to move upwards and then the right arrow enabled us to get all the way to the source precedent cells. Now we're gonna close out of this dialog box and show you how you can use Pro Precedence and Pro Dependence to actually make changes to formulas. Let's head up to this cell where we can see a value of six. Effectively, we're gonna evaluate group two, check the formulas, make sure everything's okay. From this cell, let's hit this keystroke, Control Shift, left square bracket for Pro Precedence. The dialog box opens and we can begin using the down arrow. But we can see here the numerator of 30 is actually for group three, but the denominator for group two seems okay. Let's go back up to the numerator of 30. Now to make a change, what we're gonna do is we're gonna use the F2 key. Before we hit it, let's look down here in the left corner of our Excel window where we can see the word ready. Let's tap the F2 key and now we can see that's changed to point. Now we have the ability to make a change. Let's move the cell over to group two and hit enter. And now we've changed the formula. Let's now hit escape and exit out of the tool. Might be a nice idea to check just to make sure that everything's okay. We can already see that this value has changed from six to 5.4. Let's hop into the cell, control shift left square bracket, and we can see the numerator is correct for group two. The denominator is also correct. Let's exit out. So we now know that we can use pro precedence and pro dependence to audit and trace through complex formulas super quickly without using the mouse. But we need to remember if we go into pro precedence and pro dependence, we can always tap that F2 key, make a quick change and enter to save that change. This is amazing. It's gonna save us so much time and allow us to make changes super fast. If you're enjoying these tips and would like to see more of our content, please like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for your support, and we'll see you soon in the next video.